Good afternoon, my name is Nick D4VIS. Welcome to day seven of our extreme realism challenge. That means in game a week has passed and I feel lucky today. I feel like we're gonna get some more levies. Look at that. Still only fifty-six. It's gonna take twenty-seven more days to raise up our army. Uh in the meantime, this is probably gonna be one of the quicker episodes. Let's see how England is doing also. Uh, oh yeah, we are moving real time, so this war that which usually finishes in like five seconds is still going on. The petty kingdom of Northumbria is being invaded by uh, uh, Jarl Ivor the Boneless and uh, Jarl Hofdan Whiteshirt because it's the son of the sons of Ragnar Lothbrok. Let's actually see if yeah, Ragnar Lothbrok is executed by the petty king of Northumbria. In real life, I think uh, this guy, once he died, he was like, he was executed by being turned into a blood eagle by uh, one of these brothers. But he killed, he killed Ragnar Lothbrok by throwing him into a pit of like uh, snakes. Pretty metal, and look how good he's a good character. He's wrathful, brave, gregarious, skilled tactician of his hunter, aggressive attacker, Viking, and strong. And uh, House Sigarder, and look at that, two actually different houses. But House Sigarder, House Sigarder was forged by Odin's wi wisdom. I think they still hold land in uh, Sweden. Let me see that. Yeah, yeah, they still hold Sajaland, which is uh, present day Denmark. But Snake in the Eye, he holds claims to Upland. Uh, yeah, so I think they actually, they. They originally held land in Sweden, but I think they got forced out. But Jarlborn Ironside is also fighting in the invasion of Northumbria, while the Southern English uh, Catholic anglo saxon they're, they're, they're not English, they're Anglo-Saxon. Uh, the difference is that English has Norman influence on it. Uh, that's a distinction the game makes also. But Wessex and Mercia, and I think East Anglia, uh, are uh, joining in to defend Northumbria. Northumbria is probably one of the hardest starts in the game because <laughs> you're getting attacked on two sides by uh, people the game wants to win. Like, look at this 7,000 soldiers, 6,200, and that's not even counting the allies to bring in. And so it's a it's a very very hard start. I've seen someone actually do it though. But anyway, I'm Nick D4VIS. This was just a quick little episode. We're still progressing in literally real time, so it's gonna take a while before we do anything.